confident, showing his, you know, what I brought him to the club for and that quality and has uh, been a big player for us uh, in recent months and yeah, really disappointed for him because he was starting to hit the a great bit of form, very like I just said, very confident, scoring goals, contributing really well with the team and um, performing very, very well. So um yeah, it's obviously a big blow. Get that I talked about with the players at the start of the season and um just felt that we committed to the work that we were putting in place and we showed that attitude towards it that we could uh, we could achieve something like that. So um it's been very hard, it's been good, it's been very progressive throughout the season, but you know, the players deserve massive credit for, for equaling it. But as I said before, the the whole point is to make sure we get past it and surpass it and um, hopefully we've got six games, six opportunities to do that. Hopefully we can take that. This season we really have just focused on the next game and those three points are the most crucial points that we can we can you know set our sights on. So um it's Leicester on on Saturday, it's three points to, to fight for and, and we're trying to do that again. We've done that pretty much. It's worked for us this season, focusing like that, so that's how we remain. It's pretty much how you start the season as well, that intensity, that you're fighting for your lives for different reasons. And um, I think Leicester, to be honest with you, I've been very surprised that they are where they are. They've got great quality and very good attacking-wise as well. And I've been actually surprised. I've watched a lot of their games throughout the season and I'm very surprised. I think they've been actually quite unlucky in some of those games not to have come away with more points. So, it, you know, but you are where you are. There are no excuses. So, but they've put themselves in a fantastic situation with the last two results to to be able to to get out of that situation. Is that like a, a younger one, perhaps? Well, it's definitely an area that we ha need to help and help the strikers that we have here. Obviously, we had Boney and Baffy as the recognised strikers at the start of the season. Obviously, Boney's left, um, leaving Baffy as. Um, the only real recognised striker at the club. And then obviously we brought Nelson in on loan. Obviously still need to have a good look at Nelson and, and see the situation there. Marvin, who come on, is Marvin's not um, an out-and-out -out striker. He floats between the two. And um, it's obviously an area that we do need to strengthen. And obviously we have a good look at Nelson. I've obviously worked with him already. And you know hopefully he'll get some more game time in his last six games. And, and we'll have a look at that. But we're constantly looking to try and improve those areas. And that is definitely one of them.